I believe I'm live. I'm not 100% sure. We'll find out. Just let me know if I'm live. I'll explain what we're doing here. Oh, put that over there. There we go. Do I sound okay and no echo? Can you see me? Everything's good. Let's find out real quick video and sound are good okay no echo thank you so much all right listen i'm gonna be honest with you i was pretty pissed off at that last uh stream i did i thought that's not the way i wanted to start off uh the year um those models were very very hard to do two and a half hours putting those marvel uh, models together and it was kind of a downer starting off so, I sat in the living room. I was going to let it go till tomorrow. And I sat there and I grinded and I grinded and I grinded and I grinded. And I said, you know something? I'm just going to go play something else to go over that video. I'm going to leave that video up because not all, all my videos can be good. Okay. But uh, I decided to bust uh, a little Space Hulk out, which I was planning on doing because... I am actually painting these figures for a um, for someone. Uh, matter of fact, it's for Phil. And then I've got three more sets I got to paint after this uh, of Space Hulk uh, for um, for some patrons to finish it out. So um, I said, "Oh, what the hell? You know, I got them primed. They're not pa they're not finished. They're just primed. The main thing is." I wanted to redeem myself. I love you all. So, you know, I, I try to give you my best every day. And, and if, if something isn't good, I'm going to try to do it. Now, I haven't played this in a long time. And uh, that's okay because I love this game. So, let's go up top. I mean, I've got a couple different views for you. We've got, well, this one here where we're going to be keeping an eye on different things. We've got our up and down here where we can kind of see what's going on. And then uh, we're going to be using this camera a lot because we're going to be moving. Uh, we're going to be moving a lot in, in here. I was actually thinking of putting a, one more camera up. Why not? Why not? Let's go crazy. Right? Let's go crazy. Let's see if this one works. Hold on, guys. Hold on. I mean, if we're going to do things off uh, right off the new year, we're going to do it right. Let's do it right. Right? Okay. So just give me a second here, because as usual, um, I forgot. Oh, here comes the queen, I think. What? Yeah, what's up? Oh, nice. Look at you. You're almost done. <laughs> I'll tell you, if it wasn't for the queen, she goes, you know, sometimes you just have bad streams. You got to let it go. Um, of course, I took none of her advice, and I refused to let it go. Okay, there we go. Um, let me close that out. Yeah, those are more, but I wanted to show that to you. I felt it was important uh, to show you that, you know, sometimes not everything. Okay, there we go. Uh, I, I just stuck up another camera. Why not, right? So that's the end game. Uh, we've got to get here, and we got to flame this out. So I'm, I'm going to read to you what this is about real quick. Um, this is Suicide Mission, Mission 2. Um, everybody always does Mission 1. So I, I figured I'd do a couple missions because I, I really want to do more of this. Usually you see Beachhead. Beachhead is a great mission. Um, but Suicide Mission is fun. So um, the Space Marine, Space Marine player has one squad. It consists of a sergeant armed with a Storm Bolter. Which, uh, let's go over and take a look at it. Okay, there he is. That's my boy, and he's got his sword and all that stuff. He's good. And power sword. Uh, one space marine armed with a heavy uh, flamer and power fist right there. Um, uh, one space marine armed with a uh, storm bolter and chain fist right there. And then two guys with just power fists. 
they have got a very hard, hard thing to do because what they've got to do, and we're going to go to our top view. See, this is why I put all the other cameras. See, I'm already starting to feel better about myself. Played it with my son yesterday. My only complaint with Space Marine, uh, with Space Hulk, is Gija hasn't released any expansions. I know they got a Crow's Nest. What's up? Hi, Rob. Thanks for the voucher. Got it er, uh, early version of Space Hulk. I've got three versions of Space Hulk. I'm, I'm, I'm just going to come up top here. I have three versions. I had the original first version with uh, Deathwing and all that stuff. I should have broke that out. And then I have two of these. Two of these uh, fourth or fifth editions or whatever the heck they are. Uh, I like this one the best. They just need to come out with some expansion. They could, they could do it. All right. So anyways, we've got to get our guys here. Okay. The problem is, is that the gene stealers can come in here, they can come in here, and uh, they can come in here, okay? They start off with two blips, so we're going to pick two blips. I'm going to put one here, and uh, I'm going to put one here, all right? I'm going to be the gene, I'm going to be both sides, I'm going to be very fair. We're going to roll, instead, now in the newer version, you're supposed to put all the chits into a thing. First time I am seeing Space Hulk play, well, hey... Zeblik, you just made me feel better because now I feel like I'm doing a service to you guys after that ridiculously horrible, very bad video I did. You know, I really do try. Um, normally, you would put these chits into a cup and then shake it and pull one out, and that would be the command points. Now, you each each unit has four points to use for their entire turn. Okay, so you got to be very savvy with it. Um, the command points you can use at any time. We'll explain things as you go, and I'll, I'll talk things. I'll talk you through it. I'll talk you through it. The way I like to do it is the old version. When I when I'm going for command points, I'm going to roll for command points. So, at the start of turn, oh, see, that's a bad roll. So it kind of evens out. So I have two extra command points. I could save those and use those during the gene stealer turn uh, turn to fire, or I can use them right now to press my advantage uh, somehow. All right, so without further ado, uh, let's play some Space Hulk. So uh, let me just turn this over. Uh, we, we got our command phase, which we did, and now it's going to be the Space Marine phase. So we're going to go to our, our side view here because, uh, you know, the, the one nice thing about having this camera is I can move it all over the place and make all kinds of noises. Bone Ripper, Happy New Year, my brother. See, I can go whoop, whoop. Yeah, so we can get the whole board and you guys can get a real good feel of what's going on. Listen, these aren't painted. I promise you, next time we play this game, these will be painted. This is um, just some redemption. You know what I mean? I, I just, oh, I don't like starting the year off. I'm very superstitious. And um, when things don't go well, I, I become very upset. Well, not upset, but, you know, emotionally uh, distraught. Okay, so anyways, we have two command points. Um, so here's the way we're going to do this. Um, it's going to cost us one action point to move, open up this door. Okay. Bummer, right? Uh, and then he's got one, two, and then I can come diagonally three. Okay. Uh, maybe that's not what I wanted to do, but, um, it only costs one point to go diagonal. Okay, it only costs one point to go diagonal. Um, I checked it. I made sure. Because the old rules, I thought when you went diagonal, I thought you had to turn, go, turn, go. But that's not the way it works. Um, our next guys, we're going to move for This next guy, we're going to go one, two, three, four, and get him up here. I'm almost tempted. Uh, no, I'm going to put this door over here uh, to get it out of our way. Um, we're just going to say it's open, but this way you guys can at least see it. Now, our flamer only has six flame shots. After that, if, he, if we lose the game, if we run out of flame weapons, that's not cool, dude. That's not cool. One, two, three, four. Um, I'm going to do that. Then we're going to move one, two, three, four. And then, of course, the most important guy in our squad is this dude right here. We're going to move four. All right. So, um, boy, I wish I didn't do that. 
you know what? I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Uh, actually, this is the way I'm going to. I, I would do it. I, I'm going to swap him for him. All right. The power sword has to mow the way, or else we're in trouble here. Remember, we lose the game if everybody dies or this guy dies. This guy dies. Game over. Uh, Robert Orn, if that, it that and an uh, unpainted copy of Sp see this is why this is why I don't do this. This is why this is why I don't play unpainted because I get this. Okay. Um, oh, let me let my my pupper out. Hold on, folks. Hold on. Mom closed the door and forgot to let the pup out. Go ahead, get out of here. You don't want to watch this? Go. I just wanted to make sure she was all right. All right, so that's why I never play anything unpainted because all of a sudden you get this reputation like you're some kind of painter or something like that, and then people expect everything to be painted. Well, you know something? I don't know what to tell you. Uh, this is the beginning works of a pa uh, of a patron co copy, and uh, well, actually, they're figures, not not the copy, but. Um, I just figured while I had while I was working on it, I would just uh, throw this together to kind of redeem that horrible thing I just did. All right, so um, yeah, so I want them like that. I want that right there. So let's go back to our other camera. Well, you know the funny thing is we've got we got our guy that we got to think about. We got to get there. All right, but we've got some problems here. All right, because these guys are going to move. He, he they're going to move six. Okay, so he's going to come in. Normally, this would be off. He would come in. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. They start with two, and then it's a reinforcement phase. So they're going to get two more guys. Okay, so yeah, we're going to put one there. We're going to put one there. We want to stop. Coming here, we're going to be chasing. It's when we, we bottleneck them here to prevent them from going there that we can kind of start kind of working um and coming up from behind you know uh, oops nobody wants to look at me that we can come up from behind and, and cause bedlam uh first of all let me say hi to everybody miguel uh monster tim uh sean uh bone ripper zeblik my very dearest uh barbara uh, who else do we got? Don River Vic, I see, Atomic Dog, Jason, Joe, Timmy D, uh, Crow's Nest. I want to make sure I got everybody. Okay, good. All right. So now we're going to begin our turn. So we're going to move one, two, three. It's one, two, three, four, five, six. He's going to come in one, two, three, four, five. And we're going to leave that there. He's going to come up one. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh man, here comes this. Here they come. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. So our beloved heroes are in a lot of trouble right here already off the bat because here comes all those blips. All right, just causing complete and utter bedlam. The nice thing is here, I didn't use any of my my points i could have but they're going to go away anyways and then we're going to have to roll for reinforcement they don't roll over to the next turn if i'm correct um hmm all right so you guys are looking at this and i know you're looking at it the same time i am so they went that's all fine and dandy. The minute I open this door, we're going to be able to reveal and find out who this guy is. And then we can take some shots at him. But do we want to take some shots at him right away? It really depends on how many command points we get, to be honest with you. Um, hmm. Alright, so we're going to begin our next turn. These points are go unused and then we are going to roll to see what kind of command points we get 
Oh, that is not what we needed. A one is not going to suffice. Oh, boy. Here we go. We're going to go with the, the main commander here. One, two. We're going to move the door three. Open the door. That's going to reveal here. That's two gene stealers right off the bat. And, man, they are coming head on. Head on, folks. Oh, man, this is going to get ugly quick. Uh, that was three. I could go three. I can go. Oh, boy. I could take one shot. No, I can't even do that. I'm going to put him on Overwatch. And I can put him on Overwatch. But this kind of bottlenecks us completely. Is that what I wanted to do? Because I can't shoot through my own guys. Oh, boy. So when they go to move next turn, he's going to, he's going to, he's going to be able to shoot every time they move. All right, that's fine. That's what we're going to have to do. This guy here, we are going to turn. That's going to cost us one to turn 90 degrees. We're going to open up this door. For, uh, no, we're going to move up one and open up this door. So that was one, two, three. So we have another door open. All right, let's take a... I think we got a better, better shot of it here. Um, get ready for some noise, folks. <laughs> See, I feel better already. There we go. Now, now we're looking at stuff. All right, so I want to stay there. That was one, two, three. That's about all I can do. He has to guard this back end. He may sacrifice himself, pull him back uh, diagonally. That would cost two, though. You know, that's not a bad idea, though. You know what? Yeah, but I'm going to have to put somebody on Overwatch. Um, you know, that's not the worst of ideas. Okay, instead of you putting him on Overwatch, I'm going to pull him back diagonally. That's going to cost me two. That's two action points. Okay, that means I also used... That's actually, that's actually a pretty good idea. That cost me my, my, my one command point. Okay? I'm going to move this guy up one, two, okay, and I am going to put him on Overwatch, and it costs two to go on Overwatch. Let me double check that. Uh, set Overwatch costs two, okay? Anything moves, it's going to get blasted. We're going to be able to move him up one, two. We're going to be able to bring up our Flamer, two, and that is going to be it. Here's the problem we run into. Uh, we're going to pull out two more of these. Okay. Uh, I'm going to finally put one there. And then I'm going to put another one here. He's going to go one, two, three, four. Five. Flip over. That's going to be two of them there. Oh, 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 boy. And because it was revealed, because he moved in there, we get a shot at this this first guy. Um, it's going to be two dice. If we roll a six, if we roll a six. All right, let me move some of this out here. Okay. So it, it gets out of your way. I'm going to move that over there. We're going to move this over here. We're going to move this over here. We're going to take all these dice. We're going to put them over here. And guess what? We're going to bring, we're going to bring in one of these boxes. I mean, we got these boxes. Why don't why don't we use them? They're pretty. They're nice. Um, just like the great summarize, right? Um, let's put that there because this doesn't matter. We're not using uh, psychers today. Okay, and we're going to bring out our box. Now you saw my head, which is awesome. Great, thank you. Um, there we go. We're going to bring that in. Oh. The dice of justice. We can't use those. Those aren't nobody's gonna win anything. All right, now if we get a pair, okay, if we get it doubles, our bolter's gonna jam. That's gonna be a big 
problem. But if we get doubles on a five or six, if we get double sixes, uh, he still will kill and then jam. <laughs> oh my God. How bad luck is that? All right, we kill this guy. He comes in here, okay? They're going to move up one because they can't go through each other. They're going to move up one, two, three. One, two, three. He's going to come in one, two, three. Open up the door four, five, six. Uh, wow, that's just bad luck. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. So now this is jammed. All right, that's jammed. Awesome. That's just bad luck. That is just bad luck. Let's move this out of the way here. Uh, um, I don't know if that'll mess with the camera. Let me take a look. Wow. That's some bad luck. That is some, look, look at all those gene stealers just pouring in there. Now, we haven't been able to, to roll anything good. We've got a log jam here. Um, boy, we got some problems. I'm going to move this out of the way. It's distracting, at least to me. Um, let's put it over here. No, let's. Well, after the way it worked, I'm, I'm just getting rid of it. We're going to roll right here. Um, roll better, Rob. Hey, thanks. <laughs> These guys are going to die horribly. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. All right. So we're going to roll for our command phase. We can't roll six for our command phase, though, right? Jeez. Two. Yeah, that's great. All right. So, um,. We're going to unjam for two. Okay. We're going to unjam for two. We're going to move up uh, three, four. And then we're going to go into Overwatch. We have to. These guys are going to move up. No, oh, no. I'm going to move him one. He's going to move up one. He's going to move up one. I'm putting him on Overwatch as well. Uh, where is it? There we go. He's got to be on Overwatch because the minute that thing comes through here, we got to pray that he makes it. You know, maybe I should have kept that one guy uh, as an extra. I don't know. I'll figure it out. All right, so now it is their phase, which... They're going to get two. They get two every turn. I'm going to put one there, one there. Yeah, we're just going to flood these guys. All right, let's see how this works out. This could be really, really bad. Um, We're going to start here. He's going to move one. And, oh, no, fours. Two. <laughs> All right, six and a three. That's okay. That kills him. Nice shot. One. <laughs> oh, no, it jammed. <laughs> Two, three, four, five, six. Oh, he's so close. He's so close. Brothers. <laughs> they're gonna get slaughtered okay one two three four five six right up his back end one we're gonna flip that over oh wow that's only one gene stealer that's good two three four one two that's gonna be three gene steel oh these guys are dead might as well just move them right here might as look at this this is just a train of gene stealers. You gotta love it. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now this is going to be interesting because they're going to start coming in the side here. So things are not going very well. 
Hmm. Wow. Weren't you supposed to jam on the first double? Oh, double four. Oh, you're right. All right, so they wouldn't have been able to. A good one. I, I. I how? Why am I rolling doubles? Okay, I'm just going to move everybody up. And I'm just going to put one more in the train here. There, there. He's in close combat, but they don't. Uh, the Gene Stealer doesn't have an action to fight. All right, so we'll do that. How's that? There we go. Good call. Thanks. I'm glad you caught that. I didn't even catch that, Herb. Oh, no. Who wrote that? Whoa! Thank you. Thank you for the donation, bro. I know you're having a good laugh at this. Uh, double sixes usually aren't bad. Uh, who said that? Herb. Yeah, Herb. Thanks for... Thank you so much. Uh, I didn't even catch that. And I, I didn't even realize it until it happened. Because I was in such shock of of how bad this is going. All right. So this guy is going to go. He's going to go. They can move any direction for only one. So he's going to go one, two, uh, three to open up the door. We're going to reveal it's only one. <laughs> yeah, only one. He sees him. Let's see how this turns out. So that's three. Uh, four. No doubles. Five. <laughs> oh, got him. Nice shot. All right, so that's open. He's going to come in. One, two, three, four, five, s five, six. Yeah, he, he's a gene stealer. He don't care. What does he care? He's going to come in. He's going to be seen. He's going to get shot at. Oh, and he dies. Nice. This guy can shoot. This guy can shoot. Nobody else can shoot. Glad I got back in time to catch the playthrough. Uh, the Emperor commands us. All right, so he's got he's got the power chain fist. I think it's a plus one. Hold on, guys. Hold on. This is not good. Chain fist. Uh, chain fist. Chain fists are used to slice through bulkheads, closed doors. A space marine armed with a cha uh, chain fist automatically destroys a door if they close assault it. No dice roll is necessary. Oh, really? Though they can do more damage in battle with it than a power fist. They are somewhat unwieldy and therefore are treated as a power fist in close assault with a chain stealer. Um... Wow, power fist, huh? Close assault, power fist. Uh, it's just 1d6. 1d6 versus their 3d6. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. All right, what do I do here? Can I shoot? I, I can shoot at him, I believe. Kills, thanks so much for the donation. I really... uh. I really love it. Graham Tastic uh, says, Q Iron Maiden, run to the hills. You're probably right, bro. <laughs> At this point. Uh, let's roll for our command points. Ah, oh, finally, we get six. Too bad they're all going to be dead by the time we need it. Oh, boy, what do we do here? <sighs> I think because he's in the same square, I don't think he gets a shot at him. I think he has to fight him. I think he has to close assault him, which means that pretty much he's going to die. Um, all right, let's see what happens. If we lose one, that's all right. That's that's just the way the ball rolls, bro. We just got to plow the way. All right, so the Gene Steelers are going to get three. We are going to get one. Okay. We take the highest result. And compare it to the high. Oh boy. Oh, they got a six. Oh, say goodbye to that, dude. Unless I roll a six. No, he rolls a five. We lost our boy there. All right. He sees him. He is going to shoot. Oh man, for the 
for the Emperor. All right. He's going to shoot with his first action. One. Second action. He got him. All right. That helps. Third action. He's going to fire again. Oh, jams! All right. Third action, he jams. With his fourth and one command point, we're going to unjam. Okay. So we're going to unjam. So that uses one point. Then he's going to fire again. He needs to clear this way. Two. Oh, nothing. Come on. We need to save some points here. No, nothing. Uh... Jeez, what do I do here? We've got three points left. I'm going to have him move up one and then go on. No, I'm going to have him stay back one and go on Overwatch. That's going to leave us one point. I'm going to put him on Overwatch. And uh, we're, at, we're in a log jam here, and these guys are going to die horribly. You started with Suicide <laughs> Mission? It feels like 1982 again. You can spend CP on extra shots and clearing the bolt jam. Yeah, I did. Um, but I think I, I had to use that. I mean, the way I did it, I mean, that was the only way I can do it. All right. They're going to get two, two, two uh, things. We're going to come in here. We're going to also come in here. This is not going to be good for our good friends here. All right. All right, why don't we just do it? He's going to move up one. Uh-oh. He's going to move up two. He's got to kill him here. No! Now he's going to go into close uh, combat. It's going to be three. Power sword gives you plus one. The power sword gives you plus one. Why don't we move this door out of the way? Since it's open forever now. And uh, come up to the side here. And let's watch this battle. All right, I'm going to roll this right here, and so you guys can see, oh, these gene stealers are rolling a six. All right, does our command, now if our commander dies, guess what? I probably should have moved him back. What was I thinking? Bad move. Five. Oh, five plus one, it's a push. Yeah, and if it's a push, they roll again. Now, here's the thing. Um... That was one, two, that was three. This is this fourth action. Six, what the heck? He needs a five or six. Five, he pushes again. So that was one, two, three, four. Can this commander survive? Okay, a five. Now, if he rolls a five, he can kill him. No, he rolls a one. Now we get no more command points because our commander is gone. Oh, uh, that was five and then six. Now, everybody is just going to move up the train here. This is, this is just death, death, death. There's nothing we can do. He's going to move this. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. We'll flip that over. There's three of them there. That's awesome. That's awesome. Suicide mission, baby. That's the way you start things off. All right. He's going to come in. Uh, one. Two, three, four, five, six. All right. We get no more command points because we do not have a commander. Wow. Bernardo, what's up? Can't you pull back so others can shoot? I, cu I could have pulled diagonal. No, I couldn't have pulled uh, diagonally. I could have, but... By the time I did it, it was too much. 
Hmm. You can shoot in close combat. Okay, thanks, Herb. All right, so uh, we've got four actions. We've got to plow the road here. We've got to get some space between us. Let's see what, what happens. Got him! Nice shot. That's one action. I need a chain gun or a flamer. Well, the guy's got the flamer. So that's one. Now, if I use the flamer down the hallway... Boy, I'm in a lot of trouble no matter how I look at it. There's a way out of this. So that was one shot. To move sideways. Move sideways. Doesn't. One square. Doesn't cost anything. Oh no, I can't do that. I can't move sideways. I can move back for two. I can use one of the flames right there. They're going to just keep coming. Yep, that's what we're going to do. We're going to see if this pulls off. We can't use all this ammo. This is critical now. All right, let's get that out of the way. Let's get these out of the way. There's a chance here. It's very slim. They're just going to keep coming because they're they're stupid. Leave him on Overwatch. We use two of his actions. He can. Uh, that was that was two to fire the flamer, and we can back up one. All right, let's just see what happens here. This can't be good. We have a slight chance here. We have a very slight chance. This is gone. All right. We're going to pick two more blips. We're going to have one go in here. And one go in here. Because we got enough coming up here. Let's move. Let's do this first. One, two, three. And, uh, one. Two, three, four, five, six. Now, going into flame, they have to roll back up in Overwatch. Yeah, I have I have no command points. That's the problem. Um, going into flame for this turn, they can. They have if they roll a two or higher, they die. Two. That's one dead. One, two. Dead. One, two, three. Dead. <laughs> one, two, three, four. Oh. Five. <laughs> dead. That was close. That was close. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. One, two, three, four, five, six. One. Oh, he survived that. Oh, Nelly. Um. One. That's one, two, cannot go through his own guy. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Wow. We already moved him. 
we have to move oh we already moved him no we did not move him this is uh the fourth edition i think sam uh we're gonna move here one all right bro come on overwatch so that was one okay two three four oh jammed one two three four five six oh just misses and we're jammed oh yeah talk about bad luck all right man this is not going well looks like it's going bad for the marines you said it one two three four five six and all right there we go now we go to our turn, but unfortunately, that goes away, and he's right there. Do I go in front and go one, two, three? Well, I have no command points. I think once you lose your commander, you can't roll command points. I'm pretty positive. Unless I just flame it again. I'm going to have to. I pretty much don't have any choice. So I'm going to flame this space right here for two. And then I'm going to put him on Overwatch. I'm going to turn him for one and put him on Overwatch. I'm going to put him back on Overwatch. No, I'm not going to put him on Overwatch. I'm going to... Um, I saw what that was. We'll put that on the bottom there. We'll put that right there. And we'll take these, put these there. I should put them in a cup and just draw. But there's water in the cup. All right, we're going to fire close range here. Oh, boy, come on. Got him. That took one. We're going to put him on Overwatch. Pretty much don't have too much of a choice right there. All right, let's see how this works out. This might, we just might survive this. Problem is, we've got two more blips coming on, and I'm not going to put those on until after we move everything else. I'm just going to put them there because uh, I, I, I almost got confused there. Now I'm running out of ammo. i got to be able to flame that room or else uh, this mission's over. Love this game. I've only played it three times. It's certainly dated mechanisms, but it's so enjoyable and fun. I think it's just fun. Dead people don't need no ammo. <laughs> Way to go, Crow's Nest. Way to call it. All right, they get to, and uh, yeah, here we go. This isn't going to be cool. All right, so one. Let's see if they survive. No, he's dead. One, two. Ooh, just barely. Dead. One, two, three. Dead. Oh, I love you, Flamer. One, two, three, four. Stupid Tyranid. Dead. One, two, three, four, five. Come on, die. Dead. All right, now here's where business picks up. One, two, three, four. Revealed. Three of them. Oh. One, two, Three. That's the way I should have done it. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six. All 
All right, where do I want this to come in? Actually, I'm going to want to flood these guys. So I'm going to come in one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm going to force him to go Overwatch. This goes away. It's going to go diagonal for one. Okay. No, it would be diagonal for one, turn for one. Let's be fair. Overwatch. He's going to move up. He's going to go on Overwatch. These guys have got to get out of here. Somehow, some way. I think you just... Oh, it was 1989 or 1982. Did the Flamer rule change from the first edition? In the first edition, everybody in, the, in a room or corridor died automatically. Um, if they move into it, if they move into it, it's a it's a roll. It isn't an automatic die. If the if you can survive on a roll of a one, uh, in the latest edition, that's the way they do it. And we're playing in the latest edition. All right, we're gonna grab two more blips. We're gonna put them right here. We're gonna negotiate this stuff right now. This guy's gonna come here. It's one, two d six. He sees him. Can he survive this? Uh, that's one. Two. Jam. Three, four, five, six. Right on him again. Oh, man. He's going to move. One. He's on Overwatch. Two. He jams. Oh, that could be the beginning of the end. Two, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, whoops, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, three. <laughs> Oh, man. There's only one way to die, folks. Horribly. All right. He's going to fire at him. Oh, no, 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 no. We already moved them. we got to put these blips in. Sorry. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six... One. I think here's. Yeah, no, let's come up the back end. One, two, three, four, five, six. And that's three. <laughs> I don't have enough gene stealers. I do. I just got to pull them out. Coming through the ground. <sighs> These are just. These are just primed. We're going to be dicing those up real soon. For the Emperor. Okay. Back to the Gene Stealer. We don't have a commander, so we can't get any command points. I'm not sure if that's correct or not. But I definitely shouldn't have gotten my commander killed. Um, I'm going to roll one shot here and see if that does anything. Uh, it jams. So that's awesome. So he's going to go back two and his bolter is jammed so we're gonna put that there um yeah flame uh, I got a feeling that we are just not going to survive this we're gonna drop a flame right there he uh, is going to fire on him let's see how that works out got him it's about time um, He's going to fire one more shot. Five. That's not going to do anything. And then he's going to go on Overwatch. Yeah, we're log jammed. We're going to die horribly. Okay, so... 
It is the Gene Stealer's turn. They're going to get two blips. We're going to put these two blips here. We've used almost all our, our flame ammo. Uh, we're going to need nothing but a small miracle to survive this. But hey, I've seen stranger things happen. I've seen stranger things happen. One, two. Anything but a one. Dead. One, two, three. Anything? Dead. One, two, three, four. Oh, he survived that. He's going to go one more. Five, but he dies. Um, one, two. No, these guys would come next. Three. <sighs> You know, it's only it's only a matter before we start rolling like multiple ones. Uh, that would be there. So that's one, two, three. Uh, he survived. He survived. And close assault. Can you believe that? Oh, can he survive close assault? Four. There's a chance he has a power fist. A one. Oh. And just like that, the guy that we didn't need to die, died. <sighs> Suicide mission it was. I, made, I think I made a couple tactical mistakes. We didn't, you know, I'm out. Catch you later. I, I would leave too, Dutch, after that horrible defeat. I don't blame you. Um, yeah. Real shame. Can you believe it? Double ones through a flame and was able to close the salt and, and just kill the flamer while he was on fire. Uh, sad day for the Marines, for sure. You know, one of the things I really love about this game, and, and we're going to wrap this up, um, I say we take off nuke the site from orbit. It's the only way to be sure. Nice call. Joe, nice try, says Joe. Thank you, Christopher Mar uh, Martinez. God damn. <laughs> Typical space. Hulk. The beauty thing about this edition is the components are ridiculous. This is thick glossy cardboard beautiful models um get gw we love you give us an expansion give us an expansion that's all we want give us an expansion just give us an expansion listen this makes up for it why don't we why don't we why don't we play another one tomorrow or uh would, would you like to see another another go round tomorrow maybe i'll take some time and and uh work on these tonight a little bit and uh, maybe we'll move up to, because, uh, you know, you see the same two, the same two missions because they're easy to, to broadcast. But why don't we do something really sick? Why don't we go, uh, instead of suicide mission, uh, exterminate. I mean, that's, we could do exterminate. It's either that or I was planning on doing D100. Uh, I'm going to do something tomorrow. So uh, just expect up. Uh, Please prepare to be interrupted by Inquisitor Miguel. <laughs> Michael. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I, I, you know, after after this horrible uh, death, I'm surprised they don't. They got, well, no, but let's face it. They were all going to die. That, there's no getting out of here. You, you don't run. If you're a space marine, you do not run. Um, maybe we'll take a look at the first edition even. Did you ever play uh, through Blackstone Fortress? No. It's one of the things I promised that I would get done this year, and I will get it done. So uh, we'll be back tomorrow at some point. I don't know what time. Uh, sometime in the morning. And I'm going to leave this out, and maybe we'll try to play this mission again. I, nah. Let's try something a little harder, because this wasn't hard enough for us. I hope you guys all enjoy this. I love you all. I feel much better now. Have you played Nemesis? Has a similar feel. Dying often, but having fun. Uh, I just painted it up. 
Um, you're going to see a live uh, talk through video on how I painted it up on Board Game Geek next Wednesday, which I'm going to set as soon as I get done here. Then um, we are going into Sanctum. Uh, we're going to be painting those figures. Uh, I'm going to finish up these. I've got some other things I want to finish up. Um, we're going to try to get as much in as I possibly can. Uh, I'm going to try to uh, at least stream about four or five times a week for, for the month of January. Um, I, I think I owe it to our community to really start to bring all those things that we promised uh, forward. I feel bad. Uh, you know, life's funny. Um, this definitely makes up for the Marvel Crisis Protocol uh, putting the miniature together. That was a bore fest and not the way I wanted to start the year. Space Hulk. Mac <laughs> masochism builds character. It sure does, gut bomb. Nice call, brah. <laughs> hey, I had a lot of fun. That was a lot better than what what what, uh, what we did this morning. But hey, we're going to have some stinkers, but we're going to have some good ones too, and this was a good one. I love this game. That's why it's on my top 100 list. So if you have a chance to grab a copy, make sure you grab a, co a copy. Space Hulk. That which doesn't destroy you still hurts. <laughs> busy right the start of the year that's correct that's correct all right listen uh this was a lot of fun uh i feel a lot better i think i can go in the other room and feel a lot better about what we're doing hope you guys enjoyed this it was a pleasure to bring this to you uh, be good to each other uh, be good to someone, be kind to someone, do something nice for someone because it's not only going to make you feel good, it's going to make them feel good. And on top of that, tomorrows are never guaranteed. So I hope I see you guys tomorrow and uh, we'll come back and we'll do something really, really cool. I promise you that. Jonathan Clee, my good friend, uh, glad to see you. Happy New Year's. Uh, I love you all. I mean that from the bottom of my heart. This channel doesn't have any existence without you. And, um, I'm going to tell you this, and I mean it from the bottom of my heart. I can't wait to see you guys again tomorrow when we do something else fun. Till next time, it is your old pal Rob saying we'll see you soon.